Okay, now we echo in between the double quotes diff with a class FLL, which means float left. And we close the opening diff, then echo. We echo another diff with the class LFT. And now we have image src um, we, let's enclose this in between the da, uh, curly braces obviously backslash is to escape double quotes alt equals backslash double quote and double quote we're gonna close this line and an echo helper and code html Uh, L, let's go capital letters, then row. Sorry, it's not row actually, it's product name, semicolon right at the end. And I've also forgotten actually for this encode HTML, I want this to use HTML entities without parsing any P, uh, HTML tags. So uh, one is a second parameter, then echo. Uh, double quotes backslash double quote with equals and in between a curly braces with variable and we close the image we close the div and double quote semicolon okay so that's uh, this is happening if image has been found so obviously if image is there display this image if we go back refresh the browser you can see uh, image hasn't really been found but it's displaying the the alt tag the way we wanted this so let's go back and obviously uh, i've just realized in a source field i put width rather than image if we replace this width with the image go back to the browser refresh you can see the image has loaded so it's nice now after this image if statement let's echo another div with a class write a rgt backslash double quote close it then opening h3 tag and we concatenate this with the product name let's just copy this from here and then we concatenate this with the closing h3 uh, tag and semicolon right at the end okay now we echo h4 tag strong and let's put the pound sign obviously if you're using dollars then put the dollars in dot uh, rather than product name this time it's going to be a price concatenate it with a closing strong tag and closing H for tag. Then we echo basket class and our active button. As you may remember, active button is adding and removing from the basket. And product ID is what we're going to be passing to this method. Then we echo in between the double quotes closing div tag and another closing div tag. Then semicolon right at the end. Then we echo diff with a class def, which is simply an um, ampersand hash and 160, which is basically a uh, non breakable space. You can also use uh, an VPS, it does exactly the same th uh, as this one. Are we going to be using this uh, symbol? Add an echo, open in p uh, paragraph, then helper, encode, HTML, and we're going to pass product description here and concatenate this with a closing paragraph tag. Scroll a little bit down. Okay, then echo, 
actually let's copy this one because it's going to be very similar after this uh, after dev class let's also add br td border top dashed and after this one we echo paragraph with the link href javascript this time history colon history dot go minus one so that if someone clicks on this it takes them back one page back so go back link a closing and closing paragraph and I think that's everything in this file but let's uh, let's save it go back to our front end refresh now if we have a look everything is in place if we click it's adding to the basket and removing to the from the basket as well if we go back you can see it keeps the product in the basket remove here go back to the product the link is displayed again so that's everything in this video let's move to the next one and start building our basket